everyone, so I'm going to try my best to get this all in one smooth take. Um, I have a few... Hi, baby. Hi, Dad. Have a good day. You too. Make Dad's sure working guys... overtime on 4th of July. Yep. At Apple. At Apple. You're big shot now, Dad. No. Bring me back a computer charger. Mine died. Uh-oh. <laughs> Bye, Dad. Okay, so take two. Now this one's going to be one smooth take. So I have, I didn't film anything on Friday. I know you guys are probably sick of hearing that, but I just didn't. And I have a few things that I just want to talk to you guys about. Just, I kind of had another plan for this video, but I've been reading some comments on like Strawberry 17, and maybe you're unaware of any of this. So, I mean, if this isn't something you know about, don't worry. But if you do, then I, I'm addressing it right now. Um, this is Life Burry. I'm real with you guys. I always have been. And, um, I, I appreciate you guys being understanding and knowing that my life isn't perfect. I'm not a perfect person. And I try and be honest with everything that I do. Um, there was a comment that kind of, like, along with just a bunch of other crazy comments that I got in my video, not to neglect the really nice and positive, awesome comments that I got, which they're... Like I said, they're awesome and encouraging and great. But there is just some comments that um, kind of just, I just really feel like I need to address this issue. And um, I never give attention to negative comments in a way where I'd ever make a video. But since this is life for you, I, you know, might as well be real with you guys. Um, some people, this, well, this person in particular complained about my videos lacking content and becoming more mainstream and, um, I I think I think there has been a change in my videos, but I mean there's there's something that happens when you start. Your videos aren't going to be the same as when you first started. You people change. I've changed, and um, just to be completely honest with you guys, uh, this past year has been kind of hard. I um I needed to get a job, but I didn't because I kind of there was a lot of stuff happening and. Um, I know it sounds like I'm making excuses, but uh, the closer it got to summer, I was like, there's no way I can get a job that's going to make me, t let me take a whole month off during the summer because I'm gone for the whole month of July. You'll, you guys will see I'm going to be at VidCon and then Vlog Candy's coming down. And then for the majority of August, I'll be gone as well. So it just, it wasn't going to work out. So what I had to do is basically kind of really make YouTube my job, like put all this effort into um, making my videos just kind of to another level as far as quality goes. And um, I just, just to be real, there was this pressure that, that, that came with that. And I felt like, I don't know, I just kind of felt trapped in that, like almost forced to make videos instead of doing them and, and liking them. And I'm trying to like make them a certain way so more people will comment and so I'll get more uh, uh, views and stuff like that. And I mean, when it, when it started to become more of my job, I kind of lost like the passion that I used to have in making the videos. And it's really evident. I'm like, everything that I'm feeling is really evident in my face and you can tell in my voice. So it really shows up on my videos. And um, and I'm sorry for that. I'm sorry that the quality hasn't been the greatest. I, w I wish it could be different, but um, those that's just kind of the decision that I made and I had to stick to it. And uh, not to say that I didn't have fun making the videos that I did this past year. I, I did, I did have a good time, but there has been something lacking in them that um, maybe was there, say, a year ago. Totally being, being honest with you. Um, now to move on to my recent video, which is a music video contest. Uh, I'm not like, I, I, I don't understand why people get this way whenever someone's offering like free stuff. It, there's just this mentality that nothing is for free and nothing good comes someone's way. And if it does, it must be like a gimmick or someone's intentions are wrong or <laughs> something's not good enough. I don't, I don't know, honestly. <clears throat> Seriously, there was, 
that my intentions for this music video contest was not to get more subscribers from it, not for promotional purposes, but to have something fun for you guys to do during the summer. One of the biggest complaints I've, I've gotten, like, throughout the years of doing music video contests is that it's during, like, the school year, and people are busy, and they don't have time to do it, and it's only a certain amount of time, and it's just people feel rushed, and they can't put the amount of time and effort that they want to into the music video. So... I really, I've been planning this, I've been wanting to do a summer music video contest, and this is the first one I've put together on my own. I didn't get approached by a record label, by all caps, or by high tech. I approached them and asked them if they would want to, you know, sponsor the contest, or, you know, if I could use their music to, uh, to, to, to help promote this contest. And they said yes, and the main reason why I, I, I did it was because I, I did it for you guys, and I thought it would be fun. And I got prizes this time around because I wanted it to be, I wanted them to be bigger. And um, I've done shirts and like giving away CDs and stuff in the past, but I, I wanted this to be different. And it's summer, so I don't know about you, but I go hiking a bunch in the summer and I love going to Yosemite. And that's kind of a part of what I do and I thought it'd be cool to kind of share that with you guys as well. And I mean, maybe that isn't something that interests you, but it... I can't please everyone and it would be mission impossible to try and find the perfect prize that would suit everyone. And this was this was just something I thought would be really cool to do. As far as um, subscribing to Christina, Luke, and the All Caps band, I mean, it's a video contest, guys. It's, it's, I'm giving away free stuff. It's, I, subscribe to their videos, watch them. If you don't like them, then you don't have to stay subscribed to them. It's for the video contest. I mean, I'm subscribed to them. I like their videos. I, it's not like something that, like, you guys subscribe to them. You have to be subscribed to them for the rest of your life. That's all that matters. It's it's just for the contest. With any contest, there's, like, rules and requirements, and that's just one of them. And I don't think we're asking that much, considering a subscription is free, and the prizes that we're offering are worth, you know, a bunch of money. First prize alone is over six hundred dollars, and uh, second prize is just as good, and third prize is just as great. And I'm not getting paid by anyone to do this, guys. I don't know why this always goes into people's heads, and it's just—it's like it's crazy. I don't—I don't get it. If if anything, my my goal for this music video contest was was for you, for the viewers, and um, I love watching your guys' video responses. And I know that it uh, challenges you to grow as far as making videos. And there's there's been contests that I've done where people who have never made videos before um, make their very first video as a, an entry for the contest. And that's so huge. You never know who you're inspiring. That could be the next Shane Dawson or uh, Mika Kitty or, or something like that. You, you don't know. And I... I just, I just think it's fun and I, I like doing it. That's the main reason. So now that that's said and done, I just really wanted to get that off my chest and say that. And I don't claim to be the greatest video editor on earth. I am terrible with green screen and I'm learning. So for people who got kind of crazy on me with the music video, some things fell through and I had to get creative as far as what the background was and whatnot. So I mean, for the people that did enjoy it, thank you. For the people that our editors noticed all of my chroma key fails and those bad garbage masks. I'm not, I'm not the best at those kind of things. I, I really, I did try my best. And uh, the only way to really learn, I feel like, is through trial and error. So, so there it is. That's me being completely honest and completely real with you guys. I think, I think that, um, the work that I need to start putting into my future videos. And even on Life Free, I don't give you guys 110%, but that's my life, so it's going to be different, you know? And with my future videos on Strawberry 17, I I say this all the time, that, that the views can't matter in the comments. What people say can't matter. As long as you're having fun making the video, that's all that matters. And I haven't been having as much fun as I usually do. So for those people who have noticed, um, I'm sorry. And I'm definitely going to start trying to not so much please you, but have fun making videos again and um, 
going back to who I was. It's so easy to put your confidence in what people say about you and have everything right on that, and it's it gets stressful. But this was a nice little wake-up call. And I'm sorry if you watch this whole thing and you're just like, oh my gosh, Megan, you're crazy. Why did you talk about this for so long? It was kind of a bit of a rant, and I felt like I just had to say a few things and address this issue in particular. So if I wasted a good amount of your time, I apologize. If you got anything out of this, uh, thank you for watching. Um, but that's it. I love you guys. For those people who are still subscribed to me, thank you for watching my videos and hanging in there with me. And um, I appreciate your guys' comments and allowing me to be real with you guys without, um, <sighs> without you guys getting too crazy on me. So thank you. And uh, you're probably watching this and it's 4th of July. So happy 4th of July to all the Americanos. And if you are not American, happy July 4th or July 5th or wherever it is that you are. Also, my nose and this whole... Oh, this whole side of my face is extremely red because I got sunburned on the way driving up to Monterey and the whole time I was in uh, Spirit West Coast ammo camp. So, you know, this side of my face is fine. This side's, it's good. This side, no. It's all bad. Gosh, this always happened. One year, I just got one whole arm sunburnt and the whole rest of the summer, this arm was always darker than the other one. But, in case you were wondering, um... Yes, that's it. Anyways, um, have a nice day.